bim bom bim bom bim bom bim bom Wonka's got a new one today. What is it? This is called a scumdedly umptious bar. Wow. How does he do it? My dear boy, do you ask a fish how it swims? No. Or a bird how it flies? No. no. Separate the sorrow and collect up all the all the all the. Ooh. Cause the candy man thinks it should. Ali's late. He works too hard for a little boy. Hey, I should have some time to play. Not enough hours in the day. I've yet to see you set foot on the floor. Wow. Maybe if the floor wasn't so cold. Hi, everybody. Is this your supper, Grandpa? Uh, well, it's yours too, Charlie. I'm, I'm fed, fed up, up with cabbage water. water. It's not enough. enough. Charlie, it's all we have. What are you saying? How about this? Charlie, where'd you get that? What difference does it make where he got it? Point is, he got it. The factory started working again. For a blast. But, Grandpa, someone must be helping Mr. Wonka work the factory. Thousands must be helping him. But who? Who are they? That is the biggest mystery of them all. Together, it's horrible, dangerous stuff blows you up. But mixed together in the right way is only I know how. What do you think it makes? I don't know, sir. You don't know because only I know. If you knew and I didn't know, then you'd be teaching me instead of me teaching you. And for a student to teach his teacher, it's presumptuous and rude. Do I make myself clear? Yes, sir. Good. Now, Charlie, you take the nitric acid and the glycerine. Pour. Charlie Walker's opening his factory. He's going to let people in. You sure? It's on the radio, and he's giving truckloads of chocolate away. Class dismissed. No, no, it's only for five people. Class undismissed. He said if I've got the tickets and the people who find them will win the big prize. Where's he hidden the tickets? It's like five Walker bars. You've got to buy Walker bars to find them. Class drink is missed. Grandpa, do you think I've got a chance to find one? No. I'm still having these dreams, Doctor, and I still can't stop myself from believing them. But I dreamed the Archangel appeared and whispered into my ear and told me where to find a golden Wonka ticket. And what exactly did he say? Well, what difference does that make? <laughs> Augustus Glug, the pride of this time, the fame of Western Germany, and example for the whole world. Augustus, how does it make you feel to be the first golden ticket finder? Hungry! Any other feelings? Hungry! Mr. Gloob, would you mind saying? I want it now! What's the matter with those twerps down there? For five days now, the entire flipping factory's been on the job. They haven't shelled a penis in there since Monday. They've been shelling flaming chocolate bars from dawn to dusk. Hey, come on, night! You promised I'd have it the very first day! You're going to be very unpopular around here, Henry, if you don't deliver soon. I hate to see her unhappy. I won't talk to you ever again! You're a rotten, mean fellow! You'll never give me anything I want! And I won't go to school till I have it! Baruka, sweetheart, angel! Now, there are only four tickets left in the whole world. And the whole ruddy world's hunting for them! What can I do? But now I think I can safely say that your time and money have been well spent. We're about to witness the greatest miracle of the machine age. Based on the revolutionary Computonian law of probability, this machine will tell us the precise location of the three remaining golden tickets. It says, I won't tell, that would be cheating. I'm right back on gum. I chew it all day except at meal times when I stick it behind my ear. Violet. I just wanna be appreciated. 
Now, this piece of gum here is one that I've been chewing on for three months solid, and that's a world record. It's beaten the record held by my best friend, Miss Cornelia Prince Metal. And was she mad? Hi, Cornelia. How are you, sweetie? Hey, Mike, do you think we might shut that thing off? No, are you crazy? Mike, the country wants to hear from you. The world is waiting. Can't you shut up? I'm busy. Boy, what a great show. I serve all his TV dinners right here. He's never even been to the table. Wait till I get a real one. Colt 45. Pop won't let me have one yet, will you, Pop? Not till you're 12, son. Today, we are going to learn about... percentages. You, Peter Goff, how many did you open? 150. Charlie Bucket, how many did you open? Two. That's easy. Two. Two? What do you mean, I have two? I don't care very much for chocolate. No! Well, I can't figure out just two. If you open 200 Wonka bars, apart from being dreadfully sick, you've used up 20% of 1,000, which is 15% half over again, 10%... Now that all the tickets have been found, I don't have to hide them anymore. Mm, delicious. Mm. Take it easy. You'll get a stomachache if you swallow it like that. Running and running and running. Running and running and running. Hi, sisters. Mr. Wonka is at this moment working on a fantastic invention. The everlasting gobstopper. Our everlasting gobstoppers. before anybody else. Anything you say, sweetheart. What a pleasure, and how pretty you look in that lovely mink coat. I've got three hours at home. Son, come along. Come along. Ah, 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 ah. Here we are. Oh, don't be a darn fool, Wonka. That's the way we came in. Yes. What is this, Wonka? Some kind of fun house? Why, having fun? I've had enough. <laughs> I'm not going in there. And almost everything you'll see is eatable. Edible. I mean, you can eat almost everything. But that is called cannibalism, my dear children, and is in fact frowned upon in most societies. Let me in, I'm starving! Now don't get overexcited. Don't lose your head, Augustus. We wouldn't want anyone to lose that. Yet, this is a musical lock. Rachmaninoff. Ladies and gentlemen. You've ruined your watershed, Wonka. It's polluted. It's chocolate. That's chocolate! Well, they can't be real people. Well, of course they're real people. Stuff and nonsense! No, Oompa Loompas. <laughs> From Lumpaland. Lumpaland? There's no such place. Excuse me, Mr. dear lady. Mr. Wonka, I am a teacher of geography. Oh, well, then you know all about it. And what a terrible country it is. Here to tell well, you. then you'll know all about it and know what a terrible country it is. Nothing but desolate wastes, wastes and fierce beasts. Come and live with me in peace and safety. Away from all the wang doodles and horn swagglers and snoz wangers and rotten, vermicious knids. Snoz wangers? Vermicious knids? What kind of rubbish is that? I'm sorry, but all questions must be submitted in writing. Hey, Daddy, I want an umpa lumper. I want you to get me an umpa lumper right away. All right, Roko, all right. I'll get you one before the day out. I want an umpa lumper now! Can it, you nut? Please, I beg you, Augustus! <laughs> My beautiful chocolate. Don't just stand here, do something! Help. Police. Murder. Quick, Johnny, here. Quick, just describe this. It looks like he's drowning. Dive in, save him! Oh, it's too late. Too late? He's had it now, the suction's got him. Augustus, come back! How long is it going to take him to push through? 
The suspense is terrible. He, he's going to go this time. I hope it'll last. He, he'll be made into marshmallows in five seconds. Impossible, my dear lady. That's absurd. Unthinkable. Why? Because that fight doesn't go to the marshmallow room. It goes to the fudge room. You terrible man. Who said that? What? Look sharp, or her little boy's liable to get poured into the boiler. You wind him up. I know it. He'll... Do, buddy, do. Hey, what kind of place you running here, anyhow, Wonka? What's he talking about? Voulez-vous entrer le Wonkatania? You're going to love this. Just love it. Hey, Daddy, I want a boat like this. A beautiful paddle boat, that's what I want. What she wants is a good kick in the pants. I think I'm gonna be seasick. Here, try one of these. What are they? Rainbow drops. Suck them and you can spit in seven different colors. Spitting's a dirty habit. I know a worse one. What business, you insult? Nuts. What, what's that tunnel up there? Hey, walk! I want off! Round the world and home again! What is this, a freaking? You can't possibly see where you're going, Wonka! You're right. I can't. Boy, what a great series this would be! This is kind of strange. Yes, yeah, strange, Charlie, but it's fun! <laughs> I think I'm gonna be sick. I can take a job, but this has gone too far. There's no earthly way of knowing <laughs> He's singing Which direction we are going Is the grizzly reaper mowing? Yes. yes! Keep on rowing And they're certainly not showing Any signs that they are slowing Calm down We're there Where? Here Whipped cream Coffee cream Vanilla cream Hair cream. It's a walking moisture. Any good? Yes. I told you not to, silly boy. In my entire factory. This is the one that's really going to sizzle old Slugworth. What's it do? Would you like to see? Yeah. How do you make them? I'm a trifle deaf in this ear. Speak a little louder next time. Who wants an everlasting gobstopper? Me! You? No! Hey, she's got two. I want another one. Stop squawking, you twit! Everybody has had one, and one is enough for anybody. Oh, don't you know what this is? My gum, it's gum! Wrong! It's... Wait, Jeff. I don't care. Oh, I wouldn't do that. I really wouldn't. So much Why doesn't she listen to Mr. Wonka? Because, bad. Charlie, she's a bit twit. <laughs> And a baked potato. Mm. With sour cream. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but your face is turning blue. Violet, you're turning violet, Violet. What are you talking about? Always goes wrong when we come to the dessert. Mm. Always. It, it tastes so real. Try some more. The strawberries taste like strawberries. The snozberries taste like snozberries. Snozberries? Who's the heard of a snozberry? It's an educated egg decator. It's a lot of nonsense. A little nonsense now and then is relished by the wise. Hey, Daddy, I want a golden goose. Here we go again. Daddy will get you a golden goose as soon as we get home. No, I want one of those. Bunker, how much do you want for the golden goose? They're not for sale. Name your price. She can't have one. Who said that counts? Gooses. Geeses. I want my geese to lay gold eggs for Easter. It will, sweetheart. At least a hundred a day. Anything you say. Don't care how I want it now. Hi, bitch. It's real. Taste it. It's delicious. It's just gotten smaller, that's all. <laughs> delicious. It's unbelievable. It's a miracle. It's a TV dinner. It's Wonka Vision. Mr. Wonka, can you send other things? Not just chocolate, I mean. Anything you like. What about people? People? Hmm. I don't really know. I suppose I could. Yes, I'm sure I could. I'm pretty sure I could. But it might have some messy results. Look at me! I'm gonna be the first person in the world to be sent by television! Hey! Get away from that thing! Stop! Don't! Come back! Mike! Where are you? Great. He's completely unharmed. You call that a mark? Be quiet. Why, I'm terribly busy. Whole day wasted. Goodbye to you both. Goodbye. What happened? Did we do something wrong? Yes. But I'm gonna find out. Wake the f up. Wake up.
the lifetime supply of chocolate for Charlie. Well, when does he get it? He doesn't. Why not? Because he broke the rules. <laughs> what rules? We didn't see any rules, did we, Charlie? Rules, sir. Rules. <laughs> It's all there, black and white, clear as crystal. So you get nothing. You lose. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Could you imagine? <laughs> Good day, sir. You're a crook. Build up a little boy's hopes and then smash all his dreams to pieces. You're an inhuman monster. I said good day. Come on, Charlie. Let's get out of here. Mr. Wonka? You won! You did it! You did it! I knew you would! I just knew you would! This is the great glass wonka -vader. It's an elevator. It's a wonka -vader. Just press a button and sing! You're off. And up until now, I've pressed them all. Except one. This one. Go ahead, Charlie. Me?